Hey, this is Prometheus, the only YouTuber that actually gives you full games of all the tips and schemes I post to my channel. I'll show you the good, the bad, and the ugly. Alright, so guys, if you're new to my channel, I recommend hitting that subscribe button and the notification icon because you're going to be able to basically get daily content of me providing you schemes and different tips to go ahead and take your game to the next level. Also, if you want to get this stuff in advance, I do pre-record all my tips and schemes. Take a look at my Patreon account. You should see it down in the link below. Alright, so guys, I'm going to talk about um, a play that I can guarantee is into two different playbooks. The Rams, which I've been currently building out right now, and also the, also the Washington Redskins. Washington Redskins and the Rams have identical playbooks down to the audibles to everything, so uh, you definitely want to take a look at it. So we're going to take a look at a formation out of the Gun Doubles why off week gun doubles why off week uh, I'm going to take a look at one play in particular this is a money play it's the X dagger this has got probably the most unique routes that I've seen out of this um, uh, out of this playbook uh, it's not a harassment route like the um, bench switch out of the stack formation but it's definitely a route that you can set your opponent up for some big plays so let's go ahead and take the X dagger and we're going to run this against uh, different types of play types we're going to go against just random um, nickel coverages so we're going to go against random coverages now this is very very easy to read you're essentially just making two reads the first read you're going to look at is going to be the running back out of the flat uh, that's going to be Gurley. he's going to be our main read now he's on a block and release and he gets funny separation he actually goes in between the tackle and the guard so he's actually going to a place that most people don't necessarily see now if Gurley gets covered on that particular route my next progression is going to be Watkins up top with a deep uh, with a deep in route and he gets crazy separation now what's good about this is essentially it has seven people blocking for you so it will protect you to give you some time and if you notice that the running back is not getting out your next progression is going to be Watkins up top that he's going to be the next person that you go to so first place we're going to go is we're going to go with the uh, running back underneath and that was just a bad tutorial right there. Let's go ahead and try this again. So the first place we're going to go is the running back underneath and a lot of times what's happened is he's going to be wide open so I'm going to run this play a couple more times so you can just see how easy it is with progressions uh, with this particular play. Uh, now, as you can see right here, uh, basically uh, the, both the running backs actually stayed in, the running back and the tight end stayed in, so I'm going to go ahead and take a shot up top underneath uh, because a lot of times what's going to happen is uh, they're going to block for me, giving me the deep crossing route over the middle to be able to hit my opponent for a big play. But uh, it's going to be this route underneath with the running back. You're going to be able to hit this 9 to 10 times, and I'm not setting this up saying, okay, this is how you beat against different coverages. I'm going against, to go against random coverages in nickel formations. Most most likely this is going to be blitz off the edge. It is. So I'm going to go ahead and just take that shot over the middle and look at that. Just the sail of the ball right there uh, to get picked off. So let's just try this one more time. Not working out pretty well for me right now, but uh, once again, you're just going to go ahead and dump it down to the running back if nobody follows the running back. Big play is going to be coming up. I guarantee you that, guys. Uh, it will be coming up fairly soon. Um, and right there, once again, the running back doesn't have anybody in the area, so we're just going to go ahead and dump it down right to him right there. And I'm uh, just going to keep checking it down to the running back. If no one goes in the running back's area, uh, I'm going to go ahead and check down to because eventually someone is going to come and try to cover that guy up. Uh, and then if he doesn't get covered up, now I've got the big crosser over the middle, which uh, I've kind of forced in there because I just I didn't want you guys to sit here through uh, um, a three-minute video just trying to watch me go ahead and do this. So they're really easy, easy progressions. And then uh, with the complement of these routes, you can you can hit your opponent for a good 30 yard gain up top with a deep crosser because they're going to really start becoming conscious of that underneath route by the running back. So that's what I do like about it. Uh, it's uh, it's a very very easy complement. Start with the running back first, and then you can go ahead and go to the next level, even though it's your primary read, uh, according to Madden. Uh, is that that guy's clearing out looking for a big 30 yard gain. So guys, I hope you appreciate this tip. Once thanks a lot for subscribing. And if you want we want these tips uh, coming to you more frequently, so you can get full access out of them. Go to my Patreon account, subscribe uh, for a minimum amount, and you can get these tips in advance before I release them on YouTube. So once again, thank you for your support, and until next time.